مساء الخير اهلا بكم نايس تو سي يو اجين كيف حالكم كيف حالكم نايس تو سي يو توداي ماي نيم از رقد زهير اند ام ا تيتشر ويز ارابيك ويز وافد ارابيك انستيتيو نايس تو سي يو ان ذيس ويبينار تيتشر رغد استاذ رغد سوري تو باذر يو ذا بلاك بوكسز شود اب اجين الصندوق الاسود اي وود سي تو ان شير ذن شير اونلي ذا ويبينار فايل نوت ذا هول سكرين نوت ذا ديسك توب اي ثينك ذيس واز ذا بروبلم ان ذا فيرست سيشن وي هاد سو وي هاف ناو ذا بلاك بوكسز اي نيد جست تو ميك شور وي اوفر رايد ذيس تكنيكال ايشيو سو جست Just share the webinar, the PowerPoint file only. Uh, okay, Alan, uh, Abu. Yeah, let's just try. Go ahead. Tafadari, Bismillah. Tamam. I think this is fine. Okay. So nice to see you again, guys. Ahlan Bikum. Uh, this webinar will be contacted in 10 hours. Our main focus will be learning the following greetings, at tahiyat self-introduction, at tarif bin nafs, incubations, al-mihan, and finally numbers, al-arqam. So I wish you all good luck and happy learning. Natamanna lakum. Dersan Mumtian, if everyone is here and ready, let's get started. Okay, now before we start, we want to quickly, uh, let's quickly see what we learned in last uh, webinar. So in last webinar, we talking about some greetings التحيات such as مساء الخير مساء الخير مساء النور مساء النور أهلا 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 بك أهلا بك or أهلا بك for feminine uh, And we talking about Araka Gadan, which is means see you tomorrow, Araka Gadan. And the response, Ma Salama. Araka Kariban. Araka Kariban. And finally, Yawmun Saeed. Yawmun Saeed. Walaka Aydan. Walaka or Walaki Aydan. And also, we talk about. A, a self introduction some wh questions such as mother tedros for a masculine and for feminine mother tedrusina and we say that the verb should add yanun for a feminine so mother tedrusina mother to have mother to have and mother to hibina ماذا تحبين for feminine أنا أحب اللغة العربية for example ما وظيفتك ما وظيفتك and ما وظيفتك ما لغتك for example لغتي التركية or لغتي العربية and ما لغتك or ما لغتك sorry for feminine ما لغتك لغتي العربية for example okay so now we we talk أيضا about a numbers so we learn the numbers from صفر to عشرة from zero to ten like صفر واحد اثنان ثلاثة أربعة خمسة ستة سبعة 
ثمانية تسعة وعشرة تمام <coughs> so uh, we want to uh, يعني quickly see some of WH tools that we can use it for a question uh, من أين أنت so من أين أنت means where are you from من أين أنت كيف كيف وكيف حالك how are you كيف حالك كم as you see here كم which is what we learned today so to ask with using كم which is means how for example كم عمرك how old are you كم ما like what ما uh, like ما اسمك or ما اسمك what's your name ما اسمك and ما جنسيتك or ما جنسيتك what's your nationality and أين this is what we learn today inshallah أين like where so أين تدرس where do you study أين تدرس and last one is ماذا <coughs> ماذا means what so ماذا تدرس what are you studying ماذا تدرس okay now let's focusing on كم and أين so كم first means how كم كم for example like كم عمرك how old are you كم عمرك and كم لغة تتكلم كم لغة تتكلم how many languages do you speak so كم how لغة تتكلم how many languages do you speak أين where أين like أين تدرس where do you study أين تدرس Okay, كم عمرك؟ First, عمر means old. So, عمر means a old or age, عمر. So, for NT, feminine, كم عمرك؟ كم؟ عمر كي why كي برافو because كي is the possessive pronoun for you feminine for انتي so انتي كم عمر كي عمري so we put عمر here and then we put e yeah Why I put ya? Yeah? Because e is the possessive pronoun for I. Anna. So عمري اثنتا عشرة سنة. For example, عمري اثنتا عشرة سنة. I'm 12 years old. Okay, أنت. So أنت كم عمرك؟ أنت ممتاز كم عمرك؟ أنت كم عمرك؟ عمري تسعة عشرة سنة. For example, عمري تسعة عشرة سنة. I'm 19 years old. Okay, guys. تمام. So, as we say that عمر means age or old, let's conjugate the عمر with pronoun. ضمير ضمير 
So, enter you, masculine, enter kam amruka, kam amruka, as you see here. How old are you? So, kam amruka, enter. Anti kam amruki, mumtaz, anti kam amruki. Hua, he, hua, kam amruhu, kam amruhu, because who is the possessive pronoun for he, so kam amruhu. Here, kam amruha, here, kam amruha. Khalid Umruhu Tisa Shrata Sana Khalid Umruhu Tisa Ashrata Sana Fatima Umruha Fatima Umruha Hamsa Ashrata Sana Hamsa Ashrata Sana Okay Okay, guys, now choose the correct translation for Kam Amruka. So you have, you can now a vote for Kam Amruka. So, what is the correct translation for Kam Amruka? Is how much do you weigh? How old are you? And how are you? Kam mm Amruka -hmm. means Mumtaz, bravo, Ahsantum. So Mumtaz, Mumtaz, Kam Amruka means How old are you? Mumtaz. How old are you? Omar and here. Omar and here. So here, Kam. Now you can vote, guys. So Omar plus here. Amruha, Amruhu, or Amri. Amr plus here. So here is she, right? Mm hmm. Mumtaz. So come on, guys. Amr plus here is. Okay, Amruha. This is right. So, Amruha. Why Amruha? Because here is she. So, here, Amruha. Amruhu, the second choice, means Hua. So, his. And Amri means I. Amri, Anna. Okay. So Omar plus here, Mumtaz, Amruha. Okay, what about Omar and Anti? Anti is you for feminine, right? So Omar, Anti is, is Umruha or Amruki or Amri? Mm -hmm. Mumtaz, Mumtaz. Mm-hmm. Montaz. Bravo, ya shabab. So, good job. Ahsantum. So, Omar plus 
NT is Amruki, right? Amruki because you feminine, so Amruki. Kem Amruki. Okay, yeah, Shabab. Mumtaz, shukran lakum. Shukran lakum. Now let's move to a question. It started with Kem. How? Kem. So, first, as we say, the Kem should follow with Isim. Mufrad. Isim Mufrad means a single noun, a singular noun. Tamam. So, Kem, Kem, followed by Isim Mufrad, singular noun. Okay, and this singular noun should be mansub. Mansub means, okay, isem. Mansub means with fatha. So you should add a double fatha for ism mufrad. So, kem, then, singular noun, ism mufrad, and this ism mufrad should be like mansub with two fatha. Okay, we call this fatha, so you should put double fatha. Okay. So, first example, كم يوما في الأسبوع؟ كم يوما في الأسبوع؟ How many days are in the week? So, يوم means day, يوم يوم Yawm means day, and the plural for yawm is ayyam. Ayyam. So yawm, ayyam. How many days are in the week? So as you see here, I put kam, then I put yawm because yawm is mufrad, singular, and I put a, a, a fatha, okay? I put a fatha, double fatha, for yawm. So, kam yawman fi al usbu'a? The answer could be, يوم واحد as we said the رقم واحد يوم واحد one day يومان اثنان two days so I put يوم first يومان because يومان is dual so يومان اثنان or سبعة أيام ممتاز Sabatu ayam. So, kem plus isim mufrad. Well, this singular noun should be mansu with double fatha. Okay, second example kem lugatan tatakellam. So, lugha means language. Lugha. Okay. Lugha. And the plural, lugat, lugat, 
لغات So we will focus here about the question with كم كم لغة تتكلم How many languages do you speak كم لغة تتكلم For example أربع لغات for languages So كم plus لغة single uh, single verb or singular ver uh, noun and then تتكلم How many languages do, do you speak Okay Last one كم صديقا عندك How many friends do you have كم صديقا عندك So صديق means a friend صديق is مفرد single and أصدقاء is plural so صديق وأصدقاء and the plural is أصدقاء صديق وأصدقاء so كم صديقا عندك I can say كم أصدقاء عندك because كم just followed with ism mufrad ism mufrad singular noun okay so kam sadiqan عندك how many friends do you have for example tisatu asdiqa okay tisatu asdiqa okay now uh, in this question we will choose the correct answer so we have a cam and then we have a plank. First one is cam and you should choose asdiqa or sadiq, friend. So sadiq and asdiqa. Second one is you should do, choose between yawman and ayam. So yawman, ayam. And third one is lugat, means plural, lugat and لغة. So, choose the correct answer. كم blank عندك which is means how, how many friends do you have? So, أصدقاء or صديق and why? Okay, we have Ali. مساء الخير Ali. مساء النور. كيف حالك؟ الحمد لله. Alhamdulillah. So what is the correct answer for first one? Sadiqan. Sadiqan. Limada ya Ali? Limada Sadiqan? Yani isma mufrad. Mumtaz. Shukran ya Ali. Shukran. So, shukran Ali. Ali yaqul. He said, "Kam sadiqan, mumtaz, because sadiqan is ism mufrad, a singular noun. Okay, shukran. Second one is kam. Okay, Joseph. Masaul khair, Joseph." مساء الخير جوزيف مساء الخير مساء النور شكرا what's the correct answer يا جوزيف uh, it's this one that I'm tapping first one يوم okay ممتاز شكرا thank you جوزيف Shukran. So, thank you. Shukran, ya Joseph. Joseph said, Kam yawman. Good. Bravo. Kam yawman because yawman is a singular, but ayam is a plural, and kam it's not followed with a plural, never, ever. Okay. 
third one is chem. We have Lugat and Luga. Okay, Muhammad, Masaul Khair, Ya Muhammad. Masaul Khair, Muhammad. Masaul Khair. Ahlan Ya Muhammad. Mahia al Ijaba al Sahiha. What's the correct answer? Kam Logatan Tatakalum. Mumtaz, Limada Ya Muhammad. Why? Kam it's a Logatan is Mufrat. So it comes with come. Thank you. Shukran. Shukran, ya Muhammad. Mumtaz. So Muhammad says, Kam Lugatan, Mumtaz, because Lugatan is a, a singular, Mufrad, and Kam, it's just followed with Isim Mufrad. Mumtaz, thank you. Shukran, Lakum, Jamian. Okay. <clears throat> now let's move to how. Yani, we already know how can we ask with cam. Okay. Now let's move to how can we answer with cam. Okay. So, cam. The answer for cam from three to ten takes ijame. Jame means plural, okay? So from three to 10 takes jama. This is the answer, okay? Not the question because come, it just followed with mufrad, okay? But the answer from three to 10 takes jama. Jama means plural. So from three to 10, Jama. Okay, Jama means plural. As in the following, عندي أربعة أصدقاء. So I have a four friends because here is four and four is between four, a three and ten. أصدقاء should be a plural. Jama. So we, we said that Sadiq is Mufrad and Asdaqa is Jama'ah. So, Indi, I have Arbaatu, four, Arbaatu Asdaqa. So Asdaqa here is Jama. I can't say Andi Arbaatu Sadiq, okay? Because Sadiq is a Mufrad, but Asdaqa is a Jama. So Andi Arbaatu Asdaqa, or Andi Sittatu Asdaqa. I have a six friends. So Sitta here is between three and ten. And the the uh, the noun should be a jama, sitta to asdiqa. As you see here, so first we have a single al mufrad, and second we have a plural al jama. Sadiq, from right to left, sadiq, asdiqa. أصدقاء طالب student طالب and the plural is طلاب طلاب لغة language لغة لغات لغات and last one is يوم يوم أيام أيام the plural days أيام okay let's see the following uh, examples so <clears throat> first one is كم صديقا عندك so we have a كم here then 
we have a single noun صديقاً, and this noun should be with double fatha. So, كم صديقاً عندك? How many friends do you have? And we answer like عندي. So I have عندي. So we put عندك here from the question to answer. So عندي ستة أصدقاء. So see, I say ستة أصدقاء because ستة is between three and ten and takes a plural, right? So ستة أصدقاء. Okay, كم طالبا في الصف? How many students in the class? Okay, كم طالبا في الصف? في الصف in the class عشرة طلاب عشرة طلاب ten students so because I have ten here again I put طلاب because طلاب is a plural so عشرة طلاب third example is كم لغة تتكلم how many language languages do you speak? So, كم لغة تان لغة is a مفرد single, right? And the answer could be أتكلم like I speak ثمانية لغاتين. ثمانية is eight. ثمانية and ثمانية is between three and ten. Takes a plural, right? جمع. So, أتكلم ثماني لغات. ممتاز. Last example is كم يوما في الأسبوع. كم يوما في الأسبوع. As we said, كم is followed with by singular noun. So, كم يوما. I cannot say كم أياما because أيام is plural. It's كم يوما في الأسبوع. How many days in the week? And the answer في الأسبوع سبعة تو أيام. سبعة تو because سبعة is seven between three and ten. Three, yeah, three and ten. And from the numbers from three to ten takes a جمع, right? So, سبعة تو أيامين. تمام؟ <clears throat> okay. Uh, okay. Now, let's move to a uh, translation exercise. So, عندي, I have ستة تو. Like, I have a six. أصدقاء or صديق. And remember that numbers from three to ten takes a جمع. Takes a جمع. So, عندي ستة تو. Okay, you can... You can vote, yeah, Shabab. So, عندي ستة تو. Mhm. Okay. ممتاز. Come on guys, عندي ستة تو. أصدقاء أو صديق. ممتاز. أحسنتم. برافو. 
So, عندي ستة تو أصدقاء. Right? ستة تو أصدقاء. Okay. Why? لماذا أصدقاء؟ لماذا أصدقاء؟ Why is not صديق؟ عندي ستة تو صديق. Why أصدقاء؟ Okay. نجمة يا نجمة مرحبا أهلا أهلا يا نجمة so you choose أصدقاء أو صديق أصدقاء لماذا uh, because أصدقاء is plural ممتاز and the numbers between three and ten takes أصدقاء ممتاز takes a plural جمع thank you شكرا يا نجمة Bravo, Najma. So Najma said she chose a Asdiqa because uh, Asdiqa is plural. Okay. Second one is Atakallamu. Uh, Atakallamu. Ashra. Lugha or Lugat. Lugatin or Lugatin. Atakallamu. Ashra. <clears throat> okay, so in the chat, because it's between three and ten, number six, bravo, good, Asanti. So at the Kalamu Ashar, or Ashara, Lugatin. ممتاز. Why لغاتن? Because it's عشر. So عشرة takes a plural جمع. أتكلم عشرة لغاتن. أحسنتم. Okay. ممتاز. Uh, now let's move to اختر الإجابة الصحيحة. Choose the correct answer, okay? We have three examples here, and the number, as you see here, with red color. So first one, Muhammadun yatakallamu arba'a lugatan or lugatan. Muhammadun yatakallamu arba'a. Muhammad speaks for Language or languages? Lugha or Lugat? Marhaban. Marhaban. Masa ul khair. Okay. Uh, هنا مرحبا مرحبا mm. there is no answer عارف مرحبا يا عارف عارف Hello, can you hear me? I can hear you. Ahlan. Ya Ustada. Ahlan ya Arif. Ahlan ya Ustada. Shukran. Afwan. So, Muhammadun ya thakallamu arba'a. Arba'a lugatin. Lugat is jama'a majroor, plural. Mumtaz. Bravo. Shukran ya Arif. Shukran ya Ustada. Mumtaz. So, Arif. يقول أربعة لغات because لغات is plural ممتاز okay second one is في الصف في الصف تسعة تو طالب or طلاب في الصف تسعة تو
مرحبا اي ايجاز اي ثينك السلام عليكم وعليكم السلام ما اسمك اسمي ايجاز يونس في امريكا ايجاز يونس اهلا وسهلا اهلا في الصف تسعة تسعة طلاب ممتاز احسنت شكرا يا ايجاز اهلا ممتاز سو so, ايجاز سيد في الصف تسعة طلاب بيكوز طلاب از بلورال احسنتم اوكي لاست وان از عندي عشرة تو اوكي فاطمه مرحبا يا فاطمه مرحبتين 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 تفضلي عندي عشرة اصدقاء ممتاز لماذا اصدقاء why you choose اصدقاء لان هناك عشرة صديق واحد صديق عشرة اصدقاء ممتاز شكرا يا فاطمه عفوا شكرا 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 فاطمه سو so, فاطمه uh, choose اي اصدقاء عشرة اصدقاء because the number between 3 and 10 takes a جمع plural noun okay ممتاز thank you very much شكرا جزيلا لكم شكرا <coughs> Um, okay, um, so let's move now to a second question. Um, how many languages do you speak? Kam lugatan tatakalam. So we have kam here, and then we have a luga, and luga is a single, right? Because kam should follow with singular, right? And Luga means language. So Luga means language. So Luga ten. Luga is a language. How many languages do you speak? Kam lugatan tatakallam. Okay. <clears throat> For here, kam lugatan tatakallamina. So, takallama is a verb. Takallama means speak. So yatakallam means speak in a present, yatakallam. And because anti, you feminine, I should add a yanun letter for verb, right? So. Takallama plus yanun for anti, it will be tatakallamina. So kam lugatan tatakallamina. How many languages do you speak? Atakallamu arba'a lugatin. Atakallamu arba'a lugatin. And as you see here, atakallamu means speak. Arba'a lugat. I put lugat here, Mumtaz, because from three to ten, it will take a plural. So, Luga, Lugat, right? So, Atakallamu Arba'a Lugatin. Kam Lugatan Tatakallamu? For a masculine, Kam Lugat Tatakallamu? Atakallamu Khamsa Lugatin. The same here, I put Lugat because Khamsa. So, Khamsa takes a plural. Atakallamu Khamsa. لغاتن أحسنتم Now let's conjugate the pronoun with الفعل تكلم speak تكلم So أنا 
شور ان بريزنت انا اتكلم انا اتكلم so as you see here i just add a for verb تكلم i just a so اتكلم انا i for masculine or feminine اتكلم انت you for masculine انت تتكلم so as you see here in red color i add a ت for انت you masculine and it will be تتكلم انت انت تتكلمين right as you see here i just add يانون for انت feminine Okay, so anti you feminine تتكلمين and هو يتكلم he speaks right as you see here I put يا for هو so هو يتكلم and last one is هي هي تتكلم هي تتكلم so she speaks. I just add a ta letter for she here. Khalid yatakallamu tis'a lughatin. Khalid speaks okay, nine languages and Fatima tatakallam khamsa lughatin. Fatima speaks a five languages. Okay. Antum, you. Kam lugatan tatakalamuna? Kam lugatan tatakalamuna? Okay, yeah. Il, il, ilef, ilef. Merhaban. مرحبا اوكي نجمة نجمة مرحبا يا نجمة اهلا اهلا بك كم لغة تتكلمين نجمة انا اتكلم انجليزي Okay. Okay, tamam. Shukran ya Najma. Afwan. So Najma, tatakallamu al-lugata al-Englishia. Najma, tatakallamu al-lugata al-Englishia, English language. So, lugha. We say it for wahed. We put the noun first and then wahed. So, Najma tatakallamu lugatan wahida which is means one language, wahida from wahid and because lugha is a feminine, wahida should be the same so lugatan wahida, mumtaz Okay, we have Abdullah Oh, sorry. <clears throat> Fatima, we have Fatima. Marhaban ya Fatima. Fatima. Okay. There is no answer. Okay. So, Now let's move to the next question. It started with Aina. Aina, which is means where. So Aina Tedros, where do you study? So Tedros means study. Aina Tedros 
for هي أو أنت أين تدرسين أين تدرسين and for example أنا أدرس في New York I'm studying in New York أنا أدرس في New York Okay for أنت أين تدرس أين تدرس أنا أدرس في جامعة Harvard I'm studying at Harvard University so for this question أين تدرس you can say the name of the university or just you can say the country such as أنا أدرس في New York I'm just studying in New York or you can say أنا أدرس في جامعة Harvard I'm studying at Harvard University أين تدرسون أين تدرسون Okay, we have a عارف مرحبا عارف عارف أهلا يا أستاذ أهلا يا عارف أين تدرس يا عارف أنا أدرس في أتلانتا في أين في أتلانتا أي أي أيلاندا يا أتلانتا is a city in USA Okay, تمام. شكرا يا عارف. شكرا يا أستاذ. ممتاز. Okay. أيضا هنا لدينا مرحبا. مرحبا. مساء الخير. مرحبا. مساء مساء النور مساء النور. أهلا. ما اسمك؟ أنا اسمي ديرجرا. ديرجا؟ سي. أو سي. نعم. أهلا وسهلا. أهلا بيكي. أين تدرسين؟ أنا أدرس في جامعة جورج ميسون في أمريكا. تمام، شكرا، شكرا. ممتاز. Okay. الآن يا شباب let's conjugate the pronoun with أين تدرس أين تدرس So as we know أنت you for masculine أين تدرس أين تدرس أنت you for feminine أين تدرسين ممتاز أين تدرسين؟ هو هي هو أين يدرس؟ برافو هي هي أين تدرس؟ برافو أوكي أنتم يو أنتم for masculine and feminine so أنتم أين تدرسون؟ أنتم أين تدرسون؟ so as you see here we add a wall noon أين تدرسون؟ and نحن we أين ندرس؟ أين ندرس؟ okay I just add a noon letter for نحن we so أين ندرس؟ Okay, now let's move to read the following conversation between Muhammad and Fatima. Okay, between Muhammad and Fatima. Okay, first I will read and then we can read with each other. So, between Muhammad and Fatima. Masa'u al-khayr. مساء النور كيف حالك بخير وأنت 
أنا بخير شكرا كم عمرك يا محمد عمري خمسة عشرة سنة وأنت يا فاطمة عمري أربعة عشرة سنة أين تدرسين يا فاطمة؟ أدرس في مدرسة كامبريدج أدرس في مدرسة كامبريدج أوكي Who want to read the conversation? The conversation will be between Judy مساء الخير جودي مساء الخير مساء نور كيف حالك؟ الحمد لله بخير الحمد لله So Judy you will be محمد تمام تمام or, or you will be فاطمة oh, فاطمة فاطمة وعلي مساء الخير علي مساء نور You will be محمد علي إن شاء الله تفضل <تصفيق> مساء الخير مساء النور كيف حالك؟ بخير وأنت؟ أنا بخير شكرا كم عمرك يا محمد؟ <تصفيق> أمري خمسة عشرة سنة وأنت يا فاطمة أمري أربعة عشرة سنة أين تدرسين يا فاطمة؟ أدرس في كامبريدج تمام ممتاز شكرا جودي شكرا علي نعم عفوا انتم شكرا استاذه رغد ممكن ايضا ان طالبان اخران يشاركوا ايضا هذا أكيد. تمرين جيد جدا والطلبه يرفعون ايديهم اي ثينك تو جيف انذر تو ستودنت ذا تشانس تو براكتس ثانك يو فيري ماتش شكرا جزيلا عفوا سو so, شكرا علي وشكرا جزيلا اوكي okay. الان ممكن <تصفيق> عارف مساء الخير مساء الخير مساء النور يا استاذ اهلا اهلا عارف سو so, عارف يو ويل بي محمد ان شاء الله عند نجمه مساء الخير يا نجمه نجمه او نجميه مرحبا اهلا اهلا اسمك نجمه نعم اهلا يا نجمه نجمه انت فاطمه وعارف محمد مساء الخير مساء النور كيف حالك بخير وانت انا بخير شكرا كم عمرك يا محمد عمري خمسة عشرة سنه وانت يا فاطمه عمري أربعة عشرة سنة أين تدرسين يا فاطمة؟ أدرس في مدرسة كامبريدج ممتاز ممتاز شكرا جزيلا عارف ونجمة شكرا شكرا عارف شكرا نجمة ممتاز برافو يا شباب الآن نريد أن نذهب لـ Translation Exercise So أحمد أحمد with verb درسة It will be يدرس or أدرس أحمد 
in the present. It will be Yedros or Adros. Mm -hmm. Montaz. Bravo. Montaz. Show. So Ahmed. Yedrusu. Montaz. Ahsantum ya shabab. Ahmed. Yedrusu. أنا أنا so أنا it will be تدرس or أدرس يلا شباب أنا Okay, Abdul Samad, Masa al Khairi, Abdul Samad. Abrar, okay. Merhaban, Merhaban. Okay. So, أنا ممتاز. Bravo. أنا أدرس. أنا أدرس. And فاطمة. Last one is فاطمة. So, فاطمة تدرس or أدرس. فاطمة. Fatima Mada Ijaz Marhaban ya Ijaz Ijaz Yunus Marhaban Fatima Tadrusu Mumtaz Shukran Jazilan Laka Shukran Ahlan so, Mumtaz, Fatima, Tadrusu, Bravo, Fatima, Tadrusu, because here, so here, Tadrusu, Fatima, Tadrusu. Mumtaz, ya, Shabab. Okay, now let's move to Al Adad. Three numbers, Al Adad. الأعداد the numbers so we learned already from صفر to ten today inshallah we will complete the numbers from from eleven to nineteen okay let's start first with this chart. So, as we know that wahid means one, wahid. Wahid means one. Eleven, eleven, I will put a ahad without wow, okay. Bye bye wow. I just will put a ahda and then I will put ashar, okay. Ashar, okay. Hold on a little bit. So 
as wahed is one, I will delete the wow and I will just put the had and then I will write ashar. Okay, so ahda ashar. Ahda ashar. Ahda ashar. Eleven. Ahda ashar. Okay. <clears throat> twelve. We're about twelve. Okay, as we know, Isnan, that means two, Isnan. So, Isnan means two. Twelve, I will delete the noon, drop the noon, okay? It will isna without noon, isna. And then I will put asher again. So, the asher, like double one, the asher, isna asher, isna asher, I will put the two. And then number one. Okay, so Ahda Ashar, Ithna Ashar, eleven, twelve. Ahda Ashar, Ithna Ashar. Okay, now the numbers like 13, 14, 15, I will put just the number first, like Thalatha, you know, Thalatha means three. So you will put Thalatha first. And then you will put Asher. So the number is from the Asher to Tisat Asher. First part you will put the number, and second part you will put Asher pronunciation, as you see. So Ahda Asher, 11, Ahda Asher. إثنا عشر تولف إثنا عشر ثلاثة عشر ثلاثة عشر ثرتين ثلاثة عشر I will put just ثلاثة without any dropping or any add so just ثلاثة and then I put عشر ثلاثة عشر أربعة عشر أربعة عشر فورتين أربعة عشر خمسة عشر خمسة عشر فيفتين ستة عشر I just put ستة like six and then I put عشر so, Sittat Asher means 16. Sittat Asher. Sabbat Asher. Sabbat Asher. 17. Thamaniyat Asher. Thamaniyat Asher. 18. And 19 is Tisata Asher. Tisa, you know Tisa. So Tisata Asher. Tisata Asher. So the number is from 13 to 19. Just you put the number and then the Asher without any adding. Or you, you, you don't need to, to delete anything. But just we change the Wahid and Ithnan. Wahid. I just drop the wow, so it will be which is mean eleven. Ithnan means two. I just drop the noon, and it will be Ithnan which is mean twelve. Okay, guys. So Ahda Asher, Ithnan Asher, 
ثلاثة عشر أربعة عشر خمسة عشر ستة عشر سبعة عشر ثمانية عشر and تسعة عشر تسعة عشر Okay Now we want to uh, choose the correct translation so oops wait just a minute okay uh sorry we have okay so if asher choose the correct answer for if asher is first one second one or third one جوزيف مرحبا يا جوزيف اهلا اهلا مره اخرى again so what's the correct translation for اثنا عشر first second or third it, it is um first one the uh, 12 is the right answer ممتاز شكرا شكرا يا جوزيف عفوا 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 جوزيف سو كيوت سو ممتاز اثنا عشر فيرست وان از اثنا عشر وات اباوت سبعة عشر سبعة عشر Okay. مرحبا. مرحبا يا إلف. مرحبا. أهلا. So what is the correct translation for سبعة عشر? Seventeen, second one. ممتاز. أحسنتي. شكرا. شكرا. شكرا لك so 17 is 17 second one ممتاز 15 ممتاز في الشات ممتاز so 15 is مساء الخير يا رني مساء النور اهلا 15 ممتاز برافو شكرا احسنتي شكرا أحسن. جزيلا يا رني تو 15 از لاست وان 15 احسنتم يا شباب اوكي 11 وير از 11 سو 11 Mm-hmm. Raise your hand, ya shabab. Ahda asher. Judy? Uh, it's the last one, 11. Mumtaz, shukran ya Judy. Afwan. Bravo, so ahda asher is last one. ممتاز أحسنتم برافو أوكي now let's move to another exercise so I have a lot of bins here bins means قلم قلم so the question here كم قلما في الصورة كم قلماً في الصورة. Let's start with first one and write. So كم قلماً في الصورة? And as you see here, I put كم and then كم because كم followed by a singular noun. I put قلماً with double فتحة. So كم قلماً في الصورة? 
Hello, ya shabab. Raise hand, please. Marhaban. Masaul khair. So, kam qalaman fi asura? Um, aqtashar um qalaman fi asura. Madam, again, please. Um, aqtashar qalaman fi asura. Mumtaz, shukran, shukran. Shukran, jazilan. So, ahda ashara qalaman. Ahda ashara qalaman. Bravo. Okay, next picture. Next picture. Ya Muhammad. Muhammad. Yes. Tafadda ya Muhammad, kam qalaman fi as-sura? Ahada ashara qalaman fi as-sura. First one is ahada ashar. Second one. Muhammad? Naam. Okay, so second one, the, the picture in the middle, we can count together. So, wahid. Wahid, asnan, salasa, arwa, khamsa, sitta, saba, samani, tisa, ashara, ahada ashara, asnan ashara, salasa asharata. So, kam qalaman? ثلاثة عشرة قلما في السورة. ممتاز شكرا يا محمد شكرا. أفضل. برافو سو محمد يقول ثلاثة عشرة قلما. برافو ثلاثة عشرة قلما في السورة. أوكي لاست بيكتر. لاست بيكتر. كم قلما في السورة؟ كم قلما في الصورة؟ فاطمة يا فاطمة مرحبا مساء الخير هناك ثلاثة عشرة أقلام So you talking about the middle picture uh, uh, هنا بس اثنان uh, تصاوير ماذا؟ أنا عندي أحد عشر قل... أقلام وثلاثة عشر أقلام ما عندي middle picture. Ah, oh, you you don't have a last picture? No. Okay, that's no problem. Thank you. شكراً يا فاطمة. أفضل. So فاطمة said أحد عشر أقلام and ثلاثة عشر أقلام. Can we say أحد عشرة أقلام and ثلاثة عشرة أقلام? Okay, so أحد عشرة قلما just مفرد, mm -hmm. just مفرد ممتاز, and ثلاثة عشرة قلما, right? Because the numbers from three to ten takes a plural, but the number from 11 to 99 takes a mufrad. Tamam? So, 11 قلماً, 13 قلماً. And last picture is Arif. مرحباً يا عارف. أهلاً يا أستاذي. أهلاً بك. كم قلماً في الصورة عارف? This is too late. So, okay. يلا واحد. واحد اثنان ثلاثة أربعة خمسة ستة سبعة ثمانية تسعة عشرة أحد عشرة and ثلاثة عشرة قلما ثلاثة عشر so أحد عشر and then ثلاثة عشر اثنا 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 عشرة قلما ممتاز شكرا يا عارف شكرا جزاك الله أفضل so هنا يوجد اثنا عشرة قلما okay so, Shabab, the number two is Ithnan. Ithnan, number two. For 12, I just drop the noon. Tamam. 
and it will be 12 قلما ممتاز شكرا جزيلا شكرا جزيلا لكم so let's quickly see what we learn today today we are talking about uh, greetings uh, as a review we we are uh, talking about مساء الخير and مساء النور the response مساء النور اهلا means hello اهلا and اهلا بك uh, and we're talking about some WH question or WH tools uh, to make a question. We're talking about CAM, how, CAM, <clears throat> and Aina. Aina, like CAM, Amruka, how old are you? CAM, Amruka. And for example, Amri, Tisa, Ashrat, Sana. Umri, because I. Aina, Tedros. Aina, Tedros. So, Ana Adrusu fi New York. Ana Adrusu fi New York. Okay. Um, Aina, Tedrosu, ya Arif, Arif. اهلا اهلا يا استاذ اهلا اين تدرس يا عارف اين ادرس في في نيويورك في نيويورك انا ادرس انا ادرس في نيويورك ممتاز شكرا لك عارف شكرا تو عارف يدرس في نيويورك اين تدرس انا ادرس في نيويورك اوكي اند We're talking about a uh, sual bi kam. Okay, the question started with kam, like kam sadiqan endak, how many friends you have, and we say that kam it should follow it with a singular noun, single noun, so kam sadiqan endak, andi sittatu asdiqa, andi sittatu asdiqa. And كم لغة تتكلم? How many languages you speak? So كم لغة تتكلم? أتكلم ثماني أو ثمانية لغات. Uh, okay. Uh, هنا نجمة. كم لغة تتكلمين يا نجمة? نجمة. نجمة. مرحبا نجمة أهلا كم لغة تتكلمين يا نجمة؟ أنا أتكلم كم لغة؟ الإنجليزية الإنجليزية تمام شكرا لك يا نجمة عفوا so Najma Tatakalamu Lugatan Nuwahida. You should put Luga first and then you should put the number like Wahid. So Lugatan Nuwahida. Uh, ijaz, Ijaz, Kam Lugatan Tatakalamu ya Ijaz. Anatakalamu Talata Lugat. Mahia al Arabiya. Al Arabiya, Al Punjabi, Al Urdu. Uh, Al-Anglesia. Uh, Arba Lugat. Arba Lugat. Tamam. Shukran laka ya Ijaz. Ahlan. So Ijaz ya takallam Arba Lugat. Inglesia, Arabia, Ordo, wa Bunjabi. MashaAllah. Okay. And we conjugate the pronouns with verb takallama. Like ana atakallamu. Anti tatakallamina. And huwa ya takallam. And also we talking... Uh, about uh, uh, numbers from 11 to 19 to 19 and also we uh, we take uh, al-mufrad wal-jama' so mufrad means 
singular and jama' plural, uh, such as sadiq, asdiqa, friend, sadiq, asdiqa, lugha, lugat, lugha, language, lugat, and last one is talib, tulab, student, talib, tulab. Thank you very much, guys. Thank you. Uh, I wish to see you again tomorrow, inshallah, in uh, fourth webinar. Thank you very much. And we have, I think, five minutes. If anyone have a question, please uh, raise your hand. Uh, Ustad Abdullah. Yeah, just give them just five minutes, five to ten minutes, if they need to practice or to ask. Just five to ten minutes. We have more five minutes. I think we have like four people raising their hands. So we have the opportunity now for all students to practice. You can ask the teacher in Arabic or in English. You can ask other students. It's uh, the time for you now. تفضلوا. عارف أهلا يا عارف مرحبا. Yeah, uh, Osana, one question with come, with come, right? We use uh, uh, come yo man. So we say come yo man, um, uh, come yo man. So we say how many days? We, so yo man is singular, singular mufrad, right? So why we don't say how many days? Why we say days? Come in English? Yeah, so we say uh, come yo man. So we say how many days, right? So it should be, but logically it is day, not days. Yo man is a singular mufrad, right? Yeah, right. In Arabic, we say kam yawman, like kam yawman fi al usbu'a. In so English, is, we say how many days. So why we say, why we don't say, so kam ayyamin uh, fi in, the, in that week? You, you can't you can translate this literally because grammatically in Arabic, this is wrong. Because kam, it just followed with a singular noun. So you can translate it just like kam ayyaman fi al usbu'a. Okay, okay, so I will say, uh, even though, though I say come yawman, I will say days, not day. How many days? Yeah, in, Arab, in Arabic, kam yawman means day, means day. Okay, okay, so I don't have to use kam ayyaman. Okay. No, you, you can't you can say this. Okay, Just grammatically. Yawman, have... uh, mufrad, okay. Uh, singular, mansub with uh, double fatha. So kam yawman fi al usbu. Okay, okay, jazakallah. Afwan ya arif. Shukran laka. Muhammad, Ahlan ya Muhammad. Just a question, Muhammad. maybe I, uh, yeah. Uh, so I have a question. Why we have, why we say Masahul uh, Nur? Why we cannot say Masahul uh, Khair as an answer of Masahul Khair? Okay, you're talking about the, the, the uh, response or just? The response. Okay, yani, um, it's yani, you can say Masa al Khair uh, and the, the response, okay. yeah, it could be like Masa al Khair, you can say the response Masa al Khair. Yani, there is no problem with this. You can say Masa al Nur or Masa al Khair, Ahlan wa Sahlan. There is no problem. Okay, thank you. Afwan. Uh, uh, this is just to clarify something for the students in Arabic. For example, in English, you say good morning. The reply is good morning. But in Arabic, usually you say sabah al-khair. Usually the reply is sabah al-nur. Same thing with masa al-khair, masa al-nur. It is just a culture and language issue. But I think it is valid. You can't say it, but it's, this is the way we say it. But in English, it's different. Tamam. Elif, marhaban. Marhaban. I want to uh, I want to thank you uh, firstly because these, these lessons are very useful for us, and I want to uh, say um, I study in Turkey. How can I say in Turkey in Arabic language? So you study the Arabic language in Turkey. Turkey, haha. <laughs> أنا أتكلم تركي. I don't know how to pronounce. Yeah, 
So, أنا أتكلم اللغة لغة means language. So, أنا أتكلم اللغة التركية. تركيا. Okay. Uh, I want to I want to ask uh, one question again. Um, could you send these PDF documents uh, via or through uh, email? Yes, Elif. We we emailed today. We sent on the chat all the students registered in the first and second sessions. We emailed them the recorded session on YouTube and the PDF slides. But you can also check your uh, email us at info at wafid.co. We can send you the email again. Okay, thank you. Shukran. You're welcome. You're welcome. Last one is... Merhaba. Merhaba. It's Yerja. Ahlan. I'm Aydan. I'm in the language of Arabic. Um, it's me, Leila. I don't. <laughs> um, um, I, um, did I, um, so I'll watch it. Um, um, in general, um, see, um, in general, um, for example, when we, like, if we, um, we said between three and ten, we would say, for example, I am a field call, um, um, Latin. Um, what about um, like um, Anna Liday um, Liday um, Itna Ashar As um, Asir Ka? Um, how would, would I say um, like um, Asir Ka or um, Sadir um, Sadir Ka? Thank you very much for this question, Fatima. Inshallah, in uh, 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 next webinar tomorrow, we will talking about this. Uh, but, you can, but you can thank you for this question. But you can say "itnashar asdqa" because "itnash" it's followed with "mufrad," so "itnashar sadiq." Thank you, thank you, thank you, and we see you tomorrow, um, inshallah. Inshallah. Thank you, Lucky. Tamam, and here now. Shukran, Ustada Ragad, thank you very much. Uh, shukran, Tullabun Raza, thank you, our students, and see you tomorrow, same time, inshallah. Tomorrow, Sunday, we have the fourth session, it will be the same time.